Hey, I'm Droniak, and this is a complete collectibles guide to episode 1 of Republic. I already had collectible guides for episode 1, 2, 3, but those have received some feedback over the years, and I decided that with my new playthrough, I would also do some new collectibles guides that incorporated that feedback. That means that this time the collectibles are displayed in order as I get them, based on the path I took through each episode. I also clearly display the path I take to each collectible, and I display the names of the game cartridges and banned books as I pick them up. There's also a list of all the collectibles below in a description that's ordered by collectible type and has timestamps for each collectible including the names of the game cartridges and banned books. So if you're missing a particular one, it should be relatively easy to find. I've also included the developer commentaries, which I don't think any other collectible guide actually has thus far. Now there are a few things we need to cover before we go into the collectibles themselves. First off, you don't need to collect them all on your first playthrough. Republic has a new episode plus mechanic whereby you can return to a previously completed episode at the end state of the area and just collect whatever you missed, as well as episode 1 to 3 are connected areas, which means that if you're in episode 3, you can actually go back to episode 2 and 1 areas to collect whatever collectibles you've missed. In addition, I'll point out that the developer commentaries contain spoilers, so you might not want to actually sit through them on your first playthrough. You might want to just exit out of them the moment you pick them up, in order to not spoil the game and puzzles for yourself. That's it for the intro. Uh, good luck collecting, and I'll see you on the other side. A good reminder, use the cameras to see what's in the next room. Looks like one of my colleagues has left a pin code sitting out. I once spent some time stuffed in a locker. Proceeds as planned. We will not. Sanchez. Yes, madam. Don't forget to give her the sodium thiopental injection. Yes, madam. Going in for the steel. As a certified Kickstarter. Recently, the children in Metamorphosis have been...
Last month, a pre kale got their hands on a canister. Zager cassette. Let's see what he's got on him. Got it. Few games make us think about the stories and secrets we all. The paranoia is war. Despite being obnoxious, this This is a battery charging station. Certain omni abilities will drain. Collected contraband is up by 47% in week. The Prizrak waged their campaign against Zagor from the Gentlemen, I am not going to explain this to you again. Station 17, this is Madame Prideau. Concerning that precal I had... Let's see what he's carrying. This is one of the best games I own. Well... A fingerprint scan. It would be terrible if this got into the wrong hand. This is Quinn Derringer. We've had another instance of someone screw. This game began as a Kickstarter project. Yours is mine. The girl has found one of the banned books. The Overs.
How's the sound? Dear Mr. Derringer. There is an ideal we all live by. Zega's secret compound discovered. Inside the rat hole. So settle down, children, settle down. I am as anxious... I wonder what... Prizrak. I just received an alarming message that 933 does. Zager's poisoned manifestos. More fuel for the fire. What? What is this? Mon dieu. Mireille's liberal arts education is of little benefit in this crushing environment. A cell phone charger, worthless without the phone, but no less dangerous. for anything else. Nice. My pockets are full. I would pronounce the team behind this freaky little game, but... There are many alcoves within Metamorphosis. Each one, a perfect... This is the girl's room. Hey, fishy. Three nine zero. Pyramid flags. I'll be taking this. See what he's carrying. Hmm. And had the sense to try and then fight. I'll hold on to this. I got something. A modern game with all the trappings of a great 90s art.
Nice. They call Super Hexagon a Twitch game. A Zager cuz Arranging one of the tech crews to run a full day. Going in for the steel. When I play Kentucky Route Zero, Alexander Bruce describes his game as a mind-bending psychological If the girl needs to circumvent a room full of prayers rack, The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention use this game. Nothing. Can you believe that many regard Whitman, the iconic post? I'll check his pockets. Tower Defense Games. Before we can look to the future, we must look to the one who will lead.
off. Vice Admiral Matthews of the Pacific Fleet. Fake passports and foreign currency. The overseer has an Censorship AI to be updated, expanded. Profan I'll hold on to this. One of... Let's see what he's carrying. Nice. This is an excellent dungeon crawler RPG. I can relate. This is Central. Derringer's folks distributed the new allotment of tasers. I'll take this. Pasternak, in the Soviet Union, wrote a book. Such a display of finality is premature, don't you think? Derringer. for the steel. God. Half turn based RPG, half Viking soap opera, the better. Reporting. Zager's altered manifesto was still a work in progress at the time. The first photograph Zager ever took. There's an interesting story. Zager was always inspired by uprisings. He hoped to. Zager called this photo the perfect metaphor for our times. This old school boombox is ideal for playing back any audio cassette. What the? I'm following. Voltaire suffers from the core floor. Pages from the mini manifesto. Looks like they've been ripped out. Something in those pages has me Ray quite upset. Zager's
Oh no. Scanners do not cause cancer. Metamorphosis doctors. They don't save the images. LOL. Wanted. Well, Derringer and the Overseer got what they want. Going in to pick his pockets. Got it. Uh. Let me... The fall is so immersive, I find myself. I was given this award for my loyalty to the prize rack. Cooper, I went looking for you earlier. The great thing about Kickstarter is that we can bring back classics. Derringer asked me how much money I wasted on this DFA. As a reminder that Kickstarter is, and will forever be. The box that I keep my video game cartridges in, if I... If ever there was a flawed prophet. Yeah. The team at Supergiant quit their cushy corporate job. Nabokov. A pornographer. An old Sager cassette. This looks like an old cassette tape. You may find... Derringer has a server with the nude images of every poor soul. A broken collar. The pre-cow who wore it was also...
So by now you've reached the end of the episode, and you may be wondering, dude, Troniac, you said I would have every collectible at the end of this video, yet I'm missing a Zager cassette. That's correct, because in episode 1, there's a single collectible, a single Zager cassette, that you can only get through replaying the episode in episode plus, or returning to the area in episode 2 or 3. This is because you just collected the voice print of Miss Prido, which is needed to unlock her private quarters, where the Zager cassette is located. That's a bit odd, isn't it? Congratulations, you've just hit a hundred percent on this episode. That's it for this collectible guide. I hope you found it useful and helpful, and if so, please do like and maybe subscribe to my channel for more videos. And be sure to check out my channel for the remaining collectible guides. And I'll see you in the next video.